Aloha, everybody. Welcome to today's Mountain Climber Challenge. We are going to start things off, as we always do, with a big mahalo to today's year-round supporter sponsor, Servco Foundation. They're doing a whole lot to help keep all of these virtual activities running and to help keep all of you healthy and fit during the COVID-19 pandemic. And now, demonstrating our mountain climbers, we have our fearless leader, Dan, in our old office. This time I'm the mountain climber, so I'm going to show you what that looks like, okay? So you're going into high plank position. Okay. Do I mute mine? Oops. All right, guys, so today's fitness challenge is the mountain climber. So I'm going to show you what that looks like, okay? So you're going into high plank position, okay? So for those of you that are doing all of our push-ups, high plank position is like this. With your arms fully extended and into the floor, you've got your body in as straight a line as you possibly can get it. And then the mountain climber piece is this. Basically, you're bringing your knees up. Think about trying to have them touch your elbow, okay? So mountain climber, bring your knee up. Then back to full plank, other knee up, back to full plank, other knee up. So you're just alternating legs. So for the challenge, you want to try and go fairly fast and stay in control. So it's going to look like this. I'm going to do this for 30 seconds. So that's the mountain climber. All right, good luck, everybody. So this is a modified version of the mountain climber. It's actually easier. If you want to lean on a chair or something that's sturdy, make sure it's not going to slide on you. So if you find something that's not going to slide, you can use a chair or a desk or even a wall. And then basically same movement applies. So you're just basically reaching your knees up to your elbows. And again, trying to keep your body from your head to your toes in a straight line. So this would be the modified mountain climb. And keep your core engaged. Keep your core engaged. That's right. Great advice. Awesome. And now, uh, before we follow along with our warm ups, be sure that you're in a space where you can do all of the movements. Mountain climbers take a little bit of extra room, right? Okay, now let's get warmed up. Now let's get warmed up for our fitness challenge. First thing are our washing machines. Put your arms out in front of your body, and we're going to twist side to side 10 times. And we're going to bring our shoulders perpendicular to our hips. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, good job. All right, next, windmills. We'll stretch out our shoulder joint, and what we're gonna do is be bringing our arms all the way up and back, and make sure that our elbows reach our ears. So two, three, four, five, and we're gonna wanna do this 10 times. Six, seven, eight, Nine, ten, good job. Now the other arms. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Awesome. Next, we're going to do our lower body. So we're gonna do flamingos and we're going to wanna bring our knees up and hold them one at a time while balancing on the other leg. This will stretch out kind of the back part of our butts. So bring your knee up and balance. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Awesome job. Now we're going to do the other side. Bring your knee up and then balance. And it might be hard, but try to keep it if you can. And if you can't, you're going to want to find a wall or something that you can lean on to help prop yourself up with one of your arms, all right? So bring your knee up 
And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Awesome job. Next, we're going to do kind of the same thing, but by bringing our feet back and balancing. So grab your ankle and then balance and hold. So one, two, <laughs> three, four, five. And you should really feel this through the front of your leg. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Awesome job. Now let's switch and do the other side. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Good. All right. Now we're kind of all limbered up, and let's get into our fitness challenge. All right. As usual, I will be giving all of you a three second countdown to start. And we'll do each round for 30 seconds. So at the end of each round, I'll give you a three second countdown to finish. And we'll do it three times total, OK? Now for these mountain climbers, since a lot of you have done them before, let's focus on maintaining a really, really tight core. That means tightening our stomach muscles as much as we possibly can. And let's get some speed in, right? So let's move our legs fast so we can get our hearts beating and we can really, really get that cardio exercise in. Okay, so we're gonna start this first round in three, two, one, go. Awesome, good speed, Nicole Kelly. Awesome, perfect form, Ryan. Remember, keep your core as tight as you possibly can, everybody. Good job, really squeeze those stomach muscles. Great job, Gilbert. Awesome, Kaylee. Awesome, keep going, keep going, pushing. Get those knees up, everyone. Ooh, great control, Nicole. All right, coming to an end on this first round in, keep going, keep going. I haven't said stop yet. Three, two, one. Awesome job, Ho'opio, and stop. Fantastic. Great job. We have some latecomers today. Uh, for everybody that is just now joining us, we are about to start our second round of the Mountain Climber Challenge, okay? So remember, Mountain Climber is kind of like doing high knees or bringing your knees up while you're in a plank position. If you're not quite sure what to do, uh, try to watch along as we have so, so, so many people here joining us today that are so, 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 so good at it. Okay, let's get ready to start the second round in three, two, one, go. Woo, great job, Christina. Awesome job. Remember, everyone, tighten your core. Try to maintain that plank position. Move your feet as quickly as you can so you can really just jump your knees up toward your chest fast. Get your heartbeat going. Great job, Seth. Awesome job, Jeremy. Really, really aim to get your heart racing, everyone. Awesome job, Chantel. Keep going. I didn't say stop. Keep going. Keep going. Okay. Coming to an end on the first round in three, two, one. Stop. <laughs> okay. Good job. Hopefully, our newcomers were able to get a grip on what we're doing. Um, uh, awesome, awesome. Looks like we have. Now we are going, we are about to start our last round 
If you need any water, go ahead and get some. And we are going to begin in three, two, one, go. Way to go, Teresa. Come on, come on. Remember, you want to bring your knees to your chest, everybody. Good job. Awesome. Perfect form, Nicole. And if you can move your legs a little bit faster, everyone, I know it's the third round. I know we're getting tired, but keep pushing. Just keep on pushing. Way to go, Kaylee. Okay, ending this last round. Keep going up until I say stop. Awesome job, Barb. Keep going. I know you got it. Oh, good job. Okay, and three, two, one. Keep going until I say stop. Awesome. You all did absolutely fantastic on that. Um, we do not have a health talk today. We are actually working on revamping those so that we can get some new presenters and some new content in. Hopefully all of you are going to really, really enjoy what we have planned and what we have coming up. And we hope, of course, that all of you will be joining us next week for our lunges fitness challenge. I think we all have a pretty decent idea on how to do lunges. We've done them a lot. And as always, if any of you have any health questions, bingo questions, or virtual and stay fit questions, please email me. Again, my name is Walker. My email is ha at sohawaii.org. I will get back to you as soon as I possibly can. And we will see you tomorrow for a workout with Aaron. Woo, real excited. Haven't seen our amazing coach Aaron in a while. The ID for that is 815-3406-5939. And that's Wednesday, June 16th at 3.30 p.m. Same time, same place. Uh, okay, and now as you all come off of mute, let's go ahead and say hi to each other and try to enjoy our talk story time.